What's up? Kage. Hello. And M4. Hello, hello, hello. And it is time of the month for the tier list. And it will come out before the reworks for a change, because they won't come out till next week, I don't think. And, yeah, they're not coming out this week, Thanksgiving. Slackers. So we are going to get into the Siege Tune of the Month. And let's start with you, Burger. Who is your tune of the month for Siege? Um, I have to go with Nightwing. Hands down. Used him almost every match. M4, how about you? It's tough. Uh, there's someone I used more than Nightwing in Superman? Siege, and that's Supergirl. Uh. So I'm going to go with Supergirl. How about you, Luke? I'm going Nightwing. Nightwing train, here we go. Kage. I'm gonna think here. Um I'd have to say I'd have to say Nightwing. I think I agree. I think I'm gonna go Nightwing myself. He just seems like he's a, a great character. Um let's go ahead. Yes. Let's go ahead and get into him, because he is on the line, and I haven't decided on my vote. Luke, let's start with you. You voted S. Give us your Nightwing review. I'm going S tier. Well, I'll just preface this, preface this by saying I really didn't play a whole lot of Siege this month. Um, but I did play some. And I took him to RB3, and I found that him as a leader was exceptionally good i was blown away actually by how good he was um he does a lot right it, he can get his team invisible like really easily so if the other team doesn't have true sight they're all just going to keep attacking nightwing which is good because he has a zillion stacks of evasions and to make matters worse for the other player he's got a zillion stacks of awareness and he just keeps giving awareness and evasions to his team. Or not evasions, invisibilities. So it, he just does a lot. And he has a, a built-in guaranteed stun as well. And a whole lot of call assists. So I think he's like a, a real package. You don't even have to run him as leader. You can run him off that's, lead too. That's a nice spun loot. He's a, he's a complete package. <laughs> Burger, you also what voted you S. <laughs> yeah, so Are I mean, to me, that I like his package. <laughs> <laughs> um, we all we all like uh, Dick's package. Let's, let's just put it like that. Um, so I would, I mean, when I look at it, he doesn't really need anybody um, to make him better. Like the only thing you could really ask for is somebody that's going to help your team go first just so that way the invisibility kicks in. Um, but I mean, he hits pretty hard, um, has a guaranteed stun, has call assists. Um, I mean, as well as hiding your team while he's kind of protecting himself. I mean, really he, he doesn't need anything to, to get him going. And so, um, I mean, S tier all the way for me, I mean, like really like there's, you can plug anybody else behind him and he's automatically making them better. Kage, you voted A. What's your counterpoint? Yeah. I mean, I was debating between A and S. Uh, the only reason why I didn't go S is because I can't see... He's not an auto-tune, so I just can't see, you know, a bunch of whales just plugging him away, away and, you know, having him uh, be on a whole ton of auto-teams to uh, dominate Wraith. Um, and I don't see people really reaching for him in Siege. I'm sure people find other leaders or 
other reds to use in Siege. Um, that aside, he's got a really good kit. Uh, pretty plug and play, very easy to use. Does a lot of things right. The leaders, I pretty the leader I was uh, underestimating when I first read the kit, but it's a really good leader. Um, so that said, he's got a lot of tools to uh, make him A tier. He's got the stuns, evasions, awareness. Uh, if you don't kill him first, he's going to take forever to, you know, take care of. So that's my assessment. M4, you agree with Kage on the A? Uh, the only reason I didn't uh, vote S tier on him is because he's bugged. I'm rating him as he is right now. And his biggest weakness is he's bugged and he needs a fast teammate. So he still falls under the uh, against the black flashes, you know, how it is in Siege, right? If you can deal with him early, he's he can't do what he wants to do. And that's why I, I use I said that I use Supergirl more than him because there are a few occasions where I use the Cyborg Soup's leader. Uh, but Supergirl is the way to deal with his team. So it's, if you go first, you kill his teammates, kill him, put buff immunity on him, then he can't do his thing. But once he's fixed, I am willing to bet he's going to be S tier. But right now, he's on the cusp. Not quite there for me. So what's the bug? He doesn't his teammates start. are not invisible. Yeah, he doesn't start. He's supposed to start the match giving his teammates invisibility. Right, you but they don't until notice? you get a turn. <laughs> well, because you're using fast teammates, probably. Yeah. I didn't even notice. But I would say, I mean, Dick does give a good pounding right now without a bug. So I think, I, I think I, I'm going to have to lean S myself. So that will put him in the S category as a, as a tie. Or as the tie Sounds like that deck really hits hard. Yeah, I mean, yeah, I was torn between Dick getting an A or an S or maybe another S, but yeah, he got it. Yeah. All right, let's move on to Necron. Me, Loot, and Kage withheld votes because none of us had him geared. Burger, did you end up gearing him or did you save him as a slow gear? Uh, yeah, he's still a slow gear. Okay. He's staying that way. So you, I'm just purely going off of. The times I faced him. Okay, and then M4, you have him geared, or you also? I I did. I I I streamed him last night in preparation for this. Okay. Good thing I did, because none of you guys have him geared, don't you? We well, you know, the, this game in their infinite wisdom decided that they're gonna never fix up, up and away. So now, even though I have plenty of slow gears, I just feel like I always need more. So now I'm more inclined to not gear tunes, which makes the game even more fun to not play with the new characters. So. Um, so what is your review on uh, the, this character? I, short story, I think he's a B. I'm tempted to give him a C, but he's not that bad. Uh, all right, so let's start with his leader. I'm disappointed because I thought he's going to be like another dark side type of character. I mean, he's the boss for five years. Uh, so his leader, enemy, enemy team dies, he gains five in tops. Great. But... The legendary is where he uses his basic when someone dies. Kind of sucks because his basic is bug, it doesn't transfer debuffs, and it doesn't hit hard. So the payoff for being leader is not there. And then for some reason, the dooms, I don't know if they're bugged, they kind of don't work all the time. So his only saving grace is that he his AoE kind of hits relatively hard. But then if that's his, your saving grace... I mean, there's so many other hard-hitting, you know, AO, blue AOEs like Spectre. And then he kind of puts that immunity and heal. So he's kind of a mediocre character. If you want to use him, he's viable. That does but not sound like a B to he, me, <laughs> based on your description. <laughs> he does sound like a C, huh? Yeah. His AOE kind of like is okay-ish. So that's so, and he's relatively fast. He's 124 attack. Uh, and then he gives a uh, buff, so he kind of works with Lex. That's how I use them. I use him as leader, he sucks, so he can buff Lex, and then if he gets enough int ups, his AoE can kind of nuke. And then put Doom on those who are still alive, so he's half decent. So another B tier character that can't seem to make it out of B was, um, what's her name? Miss Martian. Would you say that he's close to her level, or... I would just miss Martian over him. 
How about better than Mira? Oh yeah, Mira is that's this problem with Mira is uh, mints take a long time, yeah. a while to kick in. So, I was just um, trying to horrible. figure out what gauge where he is. <clears throat> yeah, I was kind of gauging. You know, is he better than Connor Kent or worse than Connor Kent? I'm just looking at other C tiers and. I would say he's better than Connor. Okay, so yeah, maybe he's a low B. He just—he didn't yeah. seem impressive to me at all when I've seen him. I was not afraid of him in the slightest. Mm, yeah, no. Um, Burger, any comments? You've said you faced him a fair amount. Yeah, so I mean, the only—I mean, it seemed like a couple of people were running him pretty frequently in Siege, um, and he was somebody that. You know, I kind of had to plan for a little bit just because, like, you know, if he threw Doom on there and his, his AOE did smack pretty hard. I mean, granted, like, the greens that I was taking in Siege, like, they were all L5, but generally when I was running against him, it was versus an L5 one, and the AOE did hit pretty hard. And then, you know, just any time, like, with a lot of the evasions and things like that that were happening the Siege, like, you kind of had to plan for the Doom. Um but yeah, as far as me using him, I haven't used him at all, and I, I don't plan on using him. But I could see him being um, decent if he was working correctly. All right, so he has made it to, he gets a B tune for now. And I feel, something tells me he's going to drop a lot over the coming months. Next time he, he, he cycles might. around <laughs> for some reason. So we're going to get a lot of flack for this because I, um, I actually geared I, him. Oh. I was really angry about it. After I started using him, oh, he immediately, didn't give score. immediately after I used him, I didn't no, I because I, I didn't use him in siege at all. Oh, okay. I just took him into red alerts because I just geared him, and he is horrible. I mean, I you guys are being really nice, giving him a B. <laughs> yeah, that's exact. What you just did is exactly <laughs> like, how I feel. And for those he of you listening, I have the rash. The sh- absolute <laughs> garbage. I wasted all of my gems on it. trash. I don't think Total he's going to be good in raid either. Utter trash. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so bad. I'm so angry. I should have geared White Lantern instead because you guys seem yes, to he like him. But he was so damn bugged, I was, like, angry. I'm like, I'm not gearing this guy. He's terrible. Bugged. Well, Sounds like Necron's some... bugged. Well, I'm hearing that uh, everybody on this entire game. tier list is bugged in some hey, there's, way or there's another. bugs in the game? Everybody is bugged. Well, they're going to the fix all of the bugs next month. Cast is bugged. And that's what our <laughs> five-year anniversary present is. So. All right. I'm going to share something because we, we got called out. Uh, by a popular streamer, I'm not gonna name names, uh, be- for exactly the same reason. Um, we- so I always claim I am a 20% vote on this tier, but once in a while, because of the stupid up up in a way, we go and come into the situation where a tune is ranked based on the opinion of just one person, right? So often that person is burger, right? When like Jace, so I mean. They've released a lot of bad skins lately. Do. Yeah, I mean, the paywall has not been a good character do, right? very often. So, so did somebody have a a conflict with how we ranked Jace? No, no, no. Just, just, just. Oh, all right. I'm gonna say this. Uh, I, I apologize because I, I almost didn't make it to the stream to the uh, to the podcast today. Because I apparently lost all my reputation when I voted uh, A tier for Dr. Poison. <laughs> What's wrong with A tier on Dr. Poison? I got to hear that. Well, no, because like geez, her gate is take, taking a turn and then everyone dies. So now that I said she's A tier, I the community disagrees and the popular streamer said that, yeah, my reputation is shot. So, but I... This is a service to the community, so I'm still here. Uh, but I do need to say that she's S tier. I had to say that to save my reputation, so <laughs> I have to say it. So, so you've all, I mean, you've only won World's Finest like what four times? So so wait a second. Five, but Are five, but he's counting. People pressure you to change your mind. 
No, I mean, I'm, go- like I'm going to beat it. Well, what I'm trying community. to what I'm trying to understand is is one greater than five. Because mm. that's the siege winds I'm hearing. Yeah. <laughs> not. But apparently, it, they're not all equal. So okay. the hardest one seems to count way more. So, according to some people, she, she she's borderline. She, I mean, I will admit she's. Borderline. She she is. I mean, if she made it, I was come. I came in thinking that she would be S tier. Like all of you guys are gonna say S tier, and I was like, okay, I'm fine with it. But looks like we are. We all share the same opinion. Yeah. She's a walking nuke, and then that's it. Yeah. <clears throat> Easily Pretty countered much. walking nuke. Yeah. yeah. Throw in Terra. Sorry. Yeah. AoE dumb work. Alright, so we spent way too much time on Necron. So moving on to Amazo. Does, does anybody have any thoughts on Amazo or can we just leave Masi and move on? Because he's... Uh, he sucks. He's, he's, he's terrible. He does and suck. to make matters worse, he's got metallic pasties on his nips. <laughs> <laughs> I mean... Could they created the ugliest freaking skin for Amazo you possibly can? Somebody's banging the dude's their dude's unbearable to look at. I thought I thought those were band aids from getting pulled on regularly or something, but <laughs> they're not. I'm guessing that he had nipple rings and they were ripped off, and those are metallic nipple rings, mm. nipple covers, nip covers. Back to his kit. <laughs> I tried to see if he is worth a lick. Because I know it's been months. So I couldn't... I couldn't uh, make him good. I used him in Siege and once and I didn't do it again because he almost died. So nope, he has no redeeming qualities at yeah, this I point. Yeah, I tried to use him in Siege thinking I could disease out Nightwing. But yeah, I can't disease out Nightwing. Did I lose everybody? Oh, no, we're here. Oh, we're still here. Epic, you're right. Epic fail. Amazo is terrible. Yeah. Okay. Somebody's microphone is like popping super bad. Booth? Mine? Probably yours. Wait, you got to get a new mic, man. <laughs> it's so bad. This <laughs> this mic is fine. It's <laughs> terrible. Am, am I the only one, Lou, or Burger? Do you guys hear the like loud pops in and out? I have my volume actually lower because my ears are bothering me oh. so I don't hear anything um, oh maybe when I come in and out of mute is that what's happening yeah I think that's what it is could be okay I'll I'll use the manual mute then not the physical all right that might help okay okay moving on to Lobo I see he was voted A originally. It looks like he's going to become A again. Luke, you want to move him down to a B? You want to share your thoughts? Yeah. I I don't know. I feel like he was reworked like pretty, maybe not pretty recent, but I don't know why. I feel like he's getting power crept, and I feel like he's not as tanky as he was. And that was like his best, to me, I... I liked him being like super duper tanky, but there's so many powerful tunes out there and they just whack, they just whack him. And he just isn't, he's not holding up. And the bleeds, I feel like aren't enough. He needs bigger stacks. I guess I'm just used to like Dr. Poison bleeding you out or other tunes that are just laying it on thicker. He's just not quite where he was in my mind but he's not bad at all he's just not as, as tanky as i want him and his bleeds are less if you take him rb5 he's pretty tanky and then he'll one shot blues yes mine is l5 no rbs so my my vote's a little jaded burger you also think b yeah you know he's he's not that fast and he's you know definitely not that tanky and you know honestly like i it seems like everybody that every month, like there's more and more people that have stun. It's just like, it's like, I feel like he's not that difficult to deal with. Like there is never a time that I faced him in siege and I was like, I have to plan for him right now. 
and I mean, I just if I see him on PvP, it's the same thing. Like, yeah, I just continue rolling on with the same team. It just yeah, he doesn't. Whenever he first got reworked, I was like, man, like this is worrisome. But I, I just feel like he's not that difficult now to to handle. Kaga, you still have an A. Where I'm for? I still have him as an I still have him as an A. Everything that's good about him still good. Uh, actually, you have to account for him in this siege because he can stun Nightwing even with those evasion ops. And with Supergirl, he dies, he comes back, and then bleeds you, and you could lose someone. And once someone dies, you know the turn meter down, and then he becomes a bit tanky. Um, even at L5, he's kind of once he buffs off, he's kind of hard to kill. So yeah, I'm I'd, not ready to bump him down. Yeah, I found him to be a pain to face too at times. Um, but I did the, terrible the, this uh, siege. I lost every single day. <laughs> and still made top 20. <laughs> so, go figure. Even with that RB5 logo, he's still like... Um, I mean, yeah, well, my big problem was there would be a lot of matches where I would just forget to bring a purger, which we'll get to Kyle later. Or, oh, yeah. you know, just something would happen that I would lose and stalemate. And Lobo would help, but a lot of times I'd face teams with no blues, so you know, it didn't really matter as much. And, um, but anyway, so he's still an A. Let's move on to Supergirl, who I almost wanted to vote S for her, but I went A as well. Same. She's, she's so good now. So good. Um, Luke, if you want to start. <clears throat> Me? Okay. Oh, she's <laughs> or, so or much better. Oh. I said loot, but... It's... Oh. Oh, you said loot. Oh, sorry. Oh, my bad. Yeah. I didn't hear it. Um, I didn't hear it either. I... I do think she's an A, but there are... Some, there's one thing that I didn't like about her. I don't... Originally, didn't she have heal immunity on that? Yeah. Basin? Yes. Yes. And they took that away, right? Yeah. Yes. That okay. So that now there's two things I don't like about her. So I like that her basic does damage. That is good. A lot of. Damage. But I don't like that they took. A, yeah. No, the damage is good. But I really, I want the damage and I also want the heal immunity. I want them both. I I like the heal immunity. I thought all they needed to do was ramp up the damage, stick with the heal immunity. And that would have been good. And the other thing that I didn't love was I wanted her a her boulder AOE to really smack, like annihilate, and I felt like it did nothing. Like her it, basic it, it is awesome. Dude. What is happening right now? I don't know. <laughs> what is going on? I thought we were going on a commercial. Sponsored by. <laughs> Spotify. <laughs> so, dude, that boulder wrecks <laughs> if someone on your team is below 50% health. But she I opens with it, know, and yeah. everyone is at full health, so that's why it doesn't hit hard. I don't know. I feel like it was a stupid skill. That's because Lou opens with it. Pointless. <laughs> no, I don't. I open with her basic or her buff. <clears throat> yeah, I always open I don't even buff. use her boulder because, to me, it's useless. And I don't want any of my tunes to be below half health. But if they I are, it it's health, max. The whole match. Oh, yeah. It does smack loot. It does smack. It doesn't smack. It does nothing. It's garbage. Uh, anyway, she's an A. Go ahead. Just move on. All right, Burger. What do you, what do you got for Supergirl? Uh, I, I like her. I like the changes that they made. I, you know, I love the... You had to account for her. He's like you had the risk of you know her using her too if she got hit. Um, so you know it forced me to bring impulse out, and I actually had to bring impulse to a lot of matches um, just to hope for the stun on her and and not hit her whenever you're trying to do the turn meter down. But I mean AOE on all of her damage moves, you know, hits pretty hard um, with those. You know, can hit twice like it. I really, uh, I really like, you know, what she has to offer, and so yeah, put her at A. Kage. K. 
Yeah, we lost Kage again. He's on mute. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. Kage's missing. Like, Hello. You've missed like the last three tunes, Kage. <laughs> yeah, I'm on mute. I don't know why. Anyway, <laughs> I agree with all your assessments. Let's move on. All right, M4, any final thoughts before we move on? Uh, I almost voted her S tier. It's just that there's some inconsistency with her. Um, you see how Superman just whenever you piss off, uh, hit his teammates, you piss him off. Supergirl, there's the, for the highest is 47 percent for someone to crit, but if you don't, she still has the chance to not do anything. But when she does, she does great things. And what is it with affinity resistance? I mean, there's. It could have been anything, agility up, strength up, whatever, but affinity resistance. She's the one character that affinity resistance actually seems like it helps because, I mean, if you have, if you, it's everyone. Yeah, if you run down, if you have like two red tunes left, you're you can't you can't do any damage. She won, like you you've lost, and then every now and again, your character's just doing zero damage to her for no apparent reason. So that's probably a bug. Oh, because of the uh, critical damage down. So even if they're reds. And without that affinity resistance, if they crit, they yeah. won't do any damage to her. But yes, she's. I, oh. I think but, uh, with Supergirl because she stacks so many goddamn uh, affinity ups, that's why it works. Yeah. Um, whereas other tunes, they only get like two or three at a time, but that's about it. Jace gets like fifty of them, and he still sucks. But. <laughs> <laughs> but. <laughs> All right, let's move on to Superman. And Burger, we're going to start with you because you voted S tier, and he's your man. So, yeah, I mean, I, I, uh, I know it's been a little bit of a debate with people, but I love the changes they made to him. I mean, he's hitting hard, um, you know, protecting the team, like doing everything that you would expect uh, Superman to do. I mean, his two hits hard, his one hits hard. You know, hits twice, two turn stun. You know. That way you can actually kind of slow down Spectre if, if you get lucky enough for him to hit it off the beginning. Um, I mean, really, like, he's... I, I love what they've done with him. And and he doesn't have enough skins for some reason, so if yeah. anybody's listening, yeah, I'm definitely about that. Skins. Kage, you also voted S? What's that? You voted S on Superman as well? I did, yeah. Um... Let me just say that because he's so bugged and he, like, punches you four times in a row on, like, any turn, um, you know, I think that's enough to warrant, like... Because it's a free Arcus move, you know? It's a free Arcus, like, taunt punch. Um, the only difference is he doesn't keep the death immunity all day, but who cares? He just wipes blues off the... Or, not blues, reds off the map, so... Um, can't miss. Always triggers that leader... Uh, still very annoying to fight. Uh, if you are under leveled or gear 10.5 or gear 11, level 70, you're going to have a hard time. So, that's my take. And for you voted A. Right. Yes, I did. Uh, he's he's not bugged. That punch, the reason is they did that is because they don't want to make him an Artemis. And the reason for that is he would otherwise he would just, you know, punch off the bat and then kill someone right so that's why and what else the only problem i have with him is that he would have been um uh, tier if he didn't get the, the damage immunity uh the problem is that when you he's taunting and you punch him and he has di then he won't retaliate but he's really really good i like his rework even though it's controversial for some, but I do like the rework. He's the better Arcus in my mind. Yeah, I really. That I, double punch just wrecks. I Who's really, Arcus? He fell off. The hood plays with Superman now. Yeah. Um. Very good. I voted A. I was really close to voting S. I think he's just a little too squishy to be S. He he. He gets the death immunity. I think it's just because Spectre is on literally every single team that you face. So it takes away a little bit of his potency. When you're not facing Spectre, Superman absolutely destroys the team. Oh, yeah. So For sure. I'm kind of torn on A and S because I don't want to vote him an A just because Spectre exists. But also, Spectre is on every single team. So you have to account 
you know, kind of take that new play. So I'll let Loot be the tiebreaker. You didn't vote on Superman Loot. What would you say, A or S? I can't vote. You don't Why? Can try them. Oh wow! All right, mm -hmm. so we almost need to flip a coin. Wait, why can't loot vote? I haven't even he tried it. Oh, he's boring to me. Oh, he's no. Fair. You gotta try him. He's he's very good, very good. Yeah, I think I actually agree with loot. I'm not a Superman guy. Just not a huge fan. That's all. And he wasn't even a siege character. Hey, let's make a rework. But yeah. Don't use them. Well, they did that with they did that yeah, too. No, it was really uh, stupid when they did that too. Batman. To bats, yeah, that was a waste. Yeah, and this would have this would have been this much different siege if there were Zeus. If Zeus was a bonus dude, because now you'd see two great leaders. Yeah. Yeah, and he kind of counters Nightwing. So. I'm gonna anyway. say let's let's shake up the masses. We put him as S. We're gonna get a lot of comments, so that makes it fun. So I'll I'll, I'll tie break myself and. Pick I'm just gonna give him an S. I think he's amazing. <laughs> there you go. All right. <laughs> Best character in the game. <laughs> so really? let's go. He's but only if you use his gold skin because it gives you extra HP. Yes. There you go. All right. So let's go to Swamp Thing. And you don't talk about boring character. But he was okay. The seat. Every once in a blue moon. He's just. Uh, Lobo could kill him so easy, and so could Nightwing, so he, he made me nervous. Yeah. But. Well, you voted C. Everyone else voted B. I, what, what's your C thought? I had to throw him down to a C because I, I don't – he he needs another rework <laughs> or just even a staff boost. He's really – even Nightwing just freaking eats him up. Any red, just even Lobo, anybody can kill him really easy. And I don't want to die. When I play Siege, I need everybody to live. So, like, his whole revive thing doesn't do anything for me. I don't like revive tunes. I need the, the character to stand up the whole match, not die. I don't want gimmicks. I like just a solid stand-up tune. And, An honest just, tune. I like an honest tune. He's just not honest. I mean, he's got all that green crap on him. Yeah. Like, you kill him, and then he revives. You're like, why are you lying to me? You didn't die. That's right. <laughs> yeah. Swamp thing. You use that heavy damage three. It's like, dude, that was, that was a tickle. What happened? Is that a heavy damage move? It does nothing. Yeah. It's heavy it, damage. If it crits, it kills a green. Yes, it does. It, I, I use that to kill Supergirl, but it's hard to rely on it. Yeah. Yeah. It has I mean, like, I, I just, I look at it like I had to target him first because I didn't want, like, to kill others first and then have him die and bring them back. And so I was, I did kind of, anytime I was going against him, I, I wanted to kill him first or bring somebody like Spectre that would just keep anybody else from coming back to life. But after using his AOE, but that's kind of why I left him be. Just You do kind of have to go at him first, and then coming back with the men's and then the awareness, it, it is a little bit of annoying to face him. He would have been really tough if Spectre didn't have heal immunity, but you know Spectre really lacks a lot of skills, so thankfully he has the heal immunity to make himself viable. But <laughs> Spectre. <laughs> Um, any other thoughts on Swampy? No, I'm. It's the same. Yeah. Good, good kit, but horrible stats. So yeah, he's gonna be B. Yeah. If his stats were better, I, I'd have no issue with him. Yeah, he'd be great actually with just better stats. Yeah. All right, moving on to another blase character, Cyborg Superman. I voted to see. He's just. He really. I mean, he's he's got all anti evasion abilities and. Nightwing, if you would stalemate with Nightwing, I learned early on, you couldn't rely. No, that's not true. That is not true. You can if not it, true. If not it, true. If it came down to Nightwing and Cyborg Superman, you could not win. You can. 
you just used to use this basic and then it's two and, and all of the awarenesses and immunities melt away and then you throw the rock at him and he's dead. I don't know. I, I couldn't I couldn't punch through. Once he's got too many, I couldn't do it. I, I got video of him just endlessly jumping around. Well, that's okay. If it came down to Cyborg Superman Nightwing and one other tomb, then you could never punch through. Especially if it was Superwoman because you couldn't kill Superwoman with Cyber Superman. Your, your Cyber Superman stronger, too, though. Didn't you like RB5? No, just RB1. Oh. I wanted to, but priorities. Yeah, he was anyway. Um, Burger, I'll start with you. You gave him a C. Yeah, it's not, I mean, he's underwhelming. Like, he doesn't... Um, like, nobody... Like, there's nothing that I'm looking at saying, hey, I have to plan for him in a match. So if I, if I don't have to bring anybody special to deal with somebody like I I don't really feel like they're doing much on the on the team so C tier Loot you also say C tier yeah I'm just gonna agree okay. I don't have any other comments Kage it's the same comments you gave a B again yeah I don't think he warrants a C but uh, he is I don't know his, he was a stud when he was reworked I don't know what happened <laughs> Power crap. Uh, so many stronger greens that that's what he does. Because when, before he came out, uh, Man Bat came out, right? Uh, crit immune bread. That's, yeah, you couldn't really yeah. deal with Man Bat without, right. with any green at Without him. Yep. And then he came out and he's like the strongest uh, special damage green. And then it's like that rock just destroys Man Bat. And then like, that's it. And now there's a lot of them. But one thing that he can say is that his crit immunity compared to other crit immune tunes really work. Even Wonder Girl cannot kill him outright. Spectre cannot kill him. He can really tank. The only problem he has is against bleeds. That's why it's so annoying because he can't heal him. And some See, I always Spectre, brought my Spectre against Cyborg Superman and he just yeah, because, melted him. Yeah because, yeah, because of the punch under the shields. Yeah. I mean, Grand Spectre melts see. everyone, but... That's... that's true, but it looks like we're going to lose, and he's going to be a C tier. Eh, uh -huh. loser. <laughs> 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 Moving on to Kyle Rayner. The... He's still super bugged, right? Before we get into him. He is super bugged. Okay. He is super bugged. I... Yeah. I actually geared him um, pretty quickly, used him. I know he's bugged and caused his match to leave, but I actually thought he was pretty good, and I used him a fair amount he's... in Siege. Mm -hmm. I use him a lot. I thought he was a, a solid character. I voted A. Looks like you guys voted B, but I thought he was... I mean, I like his kit. I like what he does. I think he's pretty darn good, actually. I think once he's fixed, he'll be solid A. Mm, probably. His He has good bugs, and he has bad bugs. Uh... The bad one is where he turns down the whole team, gives your turn meter down, which is yeah, super sucks. annoying. <laughs> yeah, it sucks, and it's like, what's happening? Supergirl is murdering my team, and he's just standing there. It's like, god dang it, Kyle. But on the other hand, um, his um, death immunity does not go away. So if you ha get enough turns with Kyle, and there's no pressure on the enemy team, you're safe. You can just wait and kill everyone and then put the uh, buff immunity on Nightwing and then you'll eventually win the match. I actually use him on Nightwing a lot to counter him. Uh, just use the tree on him early on and then he can't ramp and then you can kill him easy. Uh, and I put a B because of just how inconsistent he is because of the bugs. His 5 doesn't work. His purge doesn't work. So yeah. it could have been so much better but that's why he's a B right now. That purge would be so useful state. in this siege. Oh yeah, for sure. Burger, you also gave a B. Yeah, and so I, I will put a disclaimer. I haven't used him just purely from facing him. I will say I hated anybody that was bringing him in siege, with I'm all sorry. the issues that he was having. <laughs> so, uh, many time I'd face that, like you know, you, you absolutely had to account for him just because you weren't sure what bug was going to pop up when um but i think once he gets worked like his kit actually does look pretty decent he possibly could be an a 
Um, but yeah, right now, like I, there wasn't anything that screamed like, you know, he's, he needs to be on the team to, to go at it. And last, but certainly least, I mean, just kidding. <laughs> last but not least is Red Tornado Hawkeye has been asking us for like four months to add him. Maybe longer than that. Um, he's probably going to be very disappointed in this conversation, but Kage, let's start with you. <laughs> <laughs> you voted an A. <laughs> Yeah, um, I think before, a lot of us, our criticisms were that he was just kind of squishy, he needed to be hit um, to really uh, proc his passive and uh, retaliate, but I've been using him with uh, Aquaman or Supergirl, um, I think those kind of help him along the way. Um, the fact that we live in the age of Azrael as well, the uh, targeted call assists, are actually really useful. You run in with Aquaman, uh, you use that assist with him, kind of like what we did with Dead Man back in the Siege. Uh, you know, get your turn meter, team is turn meter up. Um, you know, you can find all kinds of creative ways to really uh, work around a lot of uh, different teams. Um, but, I mean, that being said, I would rather see him kind of like in between that A and B tier. I don't think he's quite as solid as like, say, Who's a who's a A character B or A A tier blue? We have Donna Troy. Don't know if he's as solid as her, but you know, I'd say he's about borderline. Yeah, I couldn't vote A. I've tried using him a couple times on some teams because I really like his animations. I like him as a character. Um, I, I even like his. I think his kit's pretty cool. But I just I don't know why I just don't find him to ever do what he's great on defense. Yes. But he never seems to do what I want him to do when I use him. Yes, I did play with him last night with Hawkeye watching, and I told him with, that I cannot vote an A for him because he he's inconsistent. His retaliation isn't guaranteed, and Terra shuts him down. He's and he's super squishy for what he wants to do. So, but when you, you're right, uh, hate mail. When you face him, especially at RP five, he's scary. Yeah, but at L five, he can't he, he can't do his job very well. I think he's one of those characters so I, I, that needs to be RB five to be to be great. Yeah, yeah. at RB five, I actually fear Hawkeye. So yeah, he's probably a solid a at RB five. Looks like like I mean, he's too power crep now with too many crazy greens. But for a long time, I can make Metallo work pretty well at RB five. Now he's really not usable. But even even with even with Aquaman, you can use Metallo. He starts with crit immunity anyway, okay, so. Good. But there's too many. Oh, that's not his problem. Just sustaining it. Yeah, but it. it well, you got to survive the turn one nuke. Really, that's the problem. And there's just the greens are out of control now. And then Spectre, yeah. of course, you, like his one saving grace is that he'll stack up a whole bunch of strength ups, and then you can nuke some blues. But Spectre just removes them. So. <laughs> <laughs> so, so that's that's what I bring him for is to hopefully get hit a few times and then kill Spectre and then. But he just he can't hold up. All right, Hawkeye, we tried, okay? We tried. We, we genuinely a tried. Anyone else have any comments on um, Red Tornado before we wrap this little puppy up? This has been a pretty long tier list, so actually, I think it's, it's good not longer to than, sign off. Actually, shorter than our usual. We're usually at an hour, so we're only at 43 minutes. So this is pretty mm -hmm. good for us, actually. So we still have 17 minutes to talk? <laughs> kind of disappointing <laughs> that we didn't vote anybody in the trash tier. We haven't had a trash tier in a while. I will give one WB a little bit of credit. The new tunes are kind of eh, B tier characters, yeah. typically. Sometimes an A. You know, they're, they're okay. No one truly sucked. The reworks this month, I mean, all three were phenomenal. I mean, either S or close to S. Um, like they, they're all argue could all be argued for S or a high A. So you can't can't say anything about the reworks this month. Um, so I think they've, they've had a, in the last several months, it's been pretty good on reworks. And the new tunes are kind of just, you know, above average. So it gives you room to kind of test them out. And then when their rework comes around. Problem is, is that. Which is actually great. It's yeah. cheaper to get the reworks to RB5. Yeah, I mean, that's, that's what I mean. It, it works out better. The only bad thing is, is that the rework isn't going to happen for a year to two years. And, you know, I mean, we're a five-year-old buggy mobile game. So, I mean, do we have I another know, five years? I, <laughs> I, I actually they will all be fixed next month. We can put in the, we can, I have a trash tier tune. 
right now. What's that? Ready? Yep. Uh, maybe, it's maybe it's not a tune, but it's it's trash. WB, your QA department is trash. <laughs> Absolute <laughs> garbage. You guys have no clue how to do QA on anything. Anything at all. It's pathetic. We offered to help you. You didn't take us up on it. And every month you give us buggy, crappy play experience. Thank you. <laughs> Happy five-year anniversary. <laughs> Happy five-year anniversary. Happy Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving. <laughs> so Keep the tab door coming. Yep. That, that's our uh, Thanksgiving thankful PSA. <laughs> what are you thankful for? <laughs> um, hopefully next but month. But I do give them credit. I'll, I'll tell you that. For, well, I can't give them credit yet, but I'm, I'm hopeful that because they're doing one less tune, one less rework, I guess, they're spending that time to fix some of the problems. I just don't know, is that enough time to fix enough yeah, problem? I was wondering the same thing. I mean, one rework. That... Would have been better, no reworks. No, nothing. Just or, take the month off. Or, just, or yeah, no, or no, just no. They, literally they give us yeah. nothing and fix everything. Well, they could have done like a the, massive sale of every tune for the month or something. The new tunes they kind of have to. Yeah, I mean, I get it, but I just don't see like one rework, and sometimes the reworks aren't that big a change. I would have been fine with zero reworks. Yeah. I would have been fine with zero I would have been good with zero as long as they fix... They fix Batwoman's retaliation. That's the first thing they should fix. That's on the list. I yeah. put it on the list. Thanks, Loot. We have been suffering with the 3K retaliation from our RB5 Batwoman. Batwoman's going to be so annoying if that thing does high damage. So. <laughs> I'm sure she is. She might become S tier. Scale with it doesn't strength. scale. Even with strength ups, it doesn't scale. It just it flat should out. It scale, just... but it doesn't. Yep. She might become S tier. Anyway, let, let's not jinx it. Yeah. Just hope it happens. All right. Well, I guess that is it. So we'll go ahead and wrap it up there. Thanks for listening, everyone. And go bust out your S-tier Superman. And have a happy Thanksgiving. <laughs> have a happy Merry Thanksgiving. Christmas, everyone. Yeah, Merry Christmas. Happy New Year. Merry New Year. Everyone. Happy Valentine's Day. <laughs> happy Kwanzaa. Hey everyone, it's Tootitron. Thank you for listening to WROL Broadcasts. If you like the show, consider becoming a patron at patreon.com slash WROL Broadcasts. You guys think if I go out of my way next siege to lose to hate a bunch, that he might send me those dirty socks of his? I hope so.